Hey, buddy. It's good to see you, Avi. Really, your goofy face and everything. I didn't expect to find you here. I mean, Kate said you were here, but I thought... I went looking for my dad, but I couldn't find him. I just can't do this now. Oh, hey. Uh, hey. Trip, look who's here. Hey, guys. Uh, hey, <clears throat> where have you been? Joan threw me and David in jail, if you can believe it. Great. So you gave these people more reason to hate us. What is going on here in Richmond? You know more about this place than the rest of us. What do we do? We just can't trust Joan. She's trying to remove David from power by pinning murders on him. Told you we couldn't trust him. I want to go save my dad. Right now. He needs our help. No way. It's just too dangerous. The best thing for our family is to get out of here. Of course you'd say that. You already tried running away once. Have you guys even looked out the window? Go look for yourself. Oh. Holy shit. Javi, even if you did get your brother free, you're not going to be able to go anywhere. Wow. As much as I don't want to be here... You sure are glad we didn't stumble into that on our own? <sighs> Fuck. Yeah. Can you imagine? We dodged a bullet, didn't we? Yeah. I think we got luckier than I even want to think about right now. It seems like we're in danger within this place and without. I, for one, would feel a whole lot safer with a few more guns to protect ourselves. That the smartest move to make right now? That's crazy. He's my brother, Kate. I have to. Okay. We have to rescue David. I know where there's guns. My dad showed me. There are lots. I can take us. Okay. Sounds like a plan. We'll get back here as soon as we can. Good luck. Come here. Kate, I... Just be careful. Look. Javi, I, I don't know if you heard us, but I think I fucked it up with Eleanor. We can talk on the way. I, about that, I, I don't think I can leave this apartment with things like this between me and her. It's just not right. I know you must have at least heard something. It happens, especially these days. Don't worry about it. Thanks. Just shouldn't have pushed it with her like I did. Wasn't fair. Too much going on already, right? Javi, come on! Just give us a minute, pal. I'm sorry, buddy. I just... I don't know what to do. With all that's going on here, everybody's feeling overwhelmed. Try to wait for the right time. Maybe she'll come around. <sighs> uh-huh. Right. Okay. Good luck out there. I'll talk it over with Eleanor and watch over things here. You've got my word. I won't let anything happen to anyone. Thank you. Javi, come on. Good luck. Stay alert. Be careful. You'll be fine. Okay. This will be great. We got this. Slow down, buddy. I've done this before, Avi. No. 
You haven't, Gabe. Not really. Some decisions, you make them in a split second, and then have to carry them the rest of your life. You understand? What do you mean, Avi? If you get cornered, and you feel your life is in danger, then show no mercy, okay? You are more important to me than any of these other people. Okay. Mercy, right? If it comes to that, Gabe. But the takeaway from that was supposed to be to protect yourself first and last, okay? Don't hurt anybody unless you have to. Okay. We don't want to make any noise and attract any attention. Hey, I can go talk to him while you sneak inside. I'll distract him. You won't do anything to me. I'll tell him I saw something suspicious. No, it's too dangerous. We can lure him away some other way, or find another way in. I, I can do this. Gabe, wait! Hey! Oh, hey. I saw something. Show me. See? You gotta trust me more. I know what I'm talking about. It's down here. The guns are through that door. either. Have to do this the hard way. Put these in your bag. We've never done this before. Just you and me. We make a pretty good team, right? The uncle-nephew one-two punch. Yeah, we do. Drop it! What the hell are you doing here? What are you doing with all that? Trying to help. I know you're pissed at me, but I want to do the right thing. For your brother. For him, for the rest of my family, for everyone. 
Yeah. It was a shit thing to do, fucking off on me like that. I know. I... Why didn't you meet me at the stronghold? We had a plan. I just can't be a part of what's going on in New Richmond. The lying and the stealing. You sound just like your brother. I know he'd want me to help you, no matter what. But why should I trust you now? As far as I can tell, you're nothing but trouble. Because what Joan is doing is wrong. I guess I can't really say no to that. And it looks like you could use all the help you can get. Awesome. I gotta grab something else real quick. Meet me by the front at five. Okay. Are you sure? I'm so sorry. Yes, I'll be fine. Don't worry about it. You have to get back to the others. Jeez, I can't leave you guys alone for two minutes, can I? He's still alive? Yeah. Just passed out. Starting to think siding with you might have not been the best idea. Toss Sleeping Beauty in the closet so nobody ah! sees him. Let me see that wound. It's really bleeding. You're gonna need that taken care of. Shit. No, it's okay. Lingard and David are close friends. We can count on him to help you. Medical facility's right nearby. It'll be quiet this time of night, too. Okay, but let's be quick. Can they really hit targets over a mile away? Not these, but some models. Javi, it's probably best if Lingard doesn't see these guns. He and David might be tight, but he's still part of Richmond's leadership council. I'll keep watch with Ava. Okay. Do any of them have laser sights? Clem? Shit, Javi, what happened to you? Ran into a little trouble. Wow, that looks like it must have hurt. I just need to get it cleaned up. You surprised me. Thought you were someone else. Looking for something? Sort of. I know this looks bad, but it's not like... It's not like what? I'm just here to talk to Lingard about where AJ is now. Anyway, I can't leave Richmond with that herd out there. Something tells me Lingard doesn't care what you're doing. He's been out of it since I got here. He's alive. Poor dumb bastard. That's gonna need more than just cleaning, Javi. I can stitch that for you. I can't promise it'll look great once it heals. It's better than nothing, though. All right. Go for it. But if I lose my arm, that's on you. Ha ha. You'll be fine. I've dealt with worse. Huh. Let me see if I can find a needle and thread for that. Clem, are you okay? I'm 
fine. I started bleeding. I know, it's a thing. I've traveled with women before, and, and they all had it. What is it? I mean, like, why is it... I just don't understand. It's totally normal. I, I mean, it's something female women have. It's, uh, what's next? It's not fun, I know that, but Kate manages. You, you'll be fine, too. Manages? How? I'm bleeding. It's supposed to happen. You'll be fine, Clem, I, I promise. Okay. I can take you back to Kate. She can help you with, uh... Javi, worry about yourself right now. We need to find a needle and thread to stitch you up first. Oh, uh, right. Penicillin. Not what I'm looking for. Cody. Hmm. Not much left. It looks like painkillers are in high demand. I wouldn't steal any medicine if I were you. It really doesn't go over well. No thanks. Jackpot. Needle and thread. All sterilized and ready to go. I think I remember how to do this. <sighs> okay. Hold still. Try not to breathe. Look, I know I'm probably not the best person to talk to about that stuff before. You weren't that bad. Thanks for, you know, being here. Basically, all this means is you could become a mom, if you wanted. Funny. I already felt like a mom. Jane said I was more of a mom than she'd ever be. 